So let's take a look at this question. We're given a figure and told in the figure shown, WZ and XY intersect at point Q. YQ equals 63, WQ equals 70, WX equals 60, and XQ equals 120. And then we're asked, what is the length of YZ? So first we should label everything we were given. So YQ is 63, then WQ is 70, WX is 60, and then XQ is 120. And now to find the length of YZ, let's call it X, we need to use small over big equals small over big. And how do we know that we need to use that? Well, these are two similar triangles because they intersect at this point. This will create two vertical angles. And therefore, we have two angles in these triangles that are similar. So what we do is we match up a side in the smaller triangle. So let's say this side to a side that it matches up with in the bigger triangle. So let's say this side. And you put that as one fraction. So 63 over 70. And you set that equal to a fraction with what you want, right? So we have in our smaller triangle an X and we would put that over 60, right? And so then all we have to do is multiply both sides by 60. And so we would get 60 times 63 over 70 is nine over 10. So 60 times nine over 10 is gonna be 54, right? So we'd get 54 equals YZ, right? Because that is X, right? So our answer here would just be 54. For more SAT help, check out the YouTube video down below.